Previously on Evan Storm, Evan and Dad go searching for more mystery military boxes. They located the old crash site and found an ammo box with a map and key inside. They became scared as they thought something was watching them. They headed towards the X on the map. They came across a spooky pumpkin graveyard before reaching the ancient riverbed. They found X marks the spot in between two large sycamore trees. After a few minutes of digging, they find a mystery military box. They took the box home and opened it up with the key that they found. Now it's time to see what's inside. Whoa, 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 and wait. What? Are you really sure that we should do this? Actually, not really. What do you see in there? Uh, it, what is it, that? It's a little flamethrower army guy. Oh, what? It's a little flamethrower army guy. Oh, there's an army guy in there. wonder what that thing's doing in there. What else do you see? A big foot. Wait, what is it? A big foot? Wait a minute. This looks like an ornament for the Christmas tree. That is an ornament. It's a Bigfoot ornament. How wait, cool is that? Wait, there's another one. Oh, <gasps> check it out. There are two Bigfoot ornaments. Wait. So far, we found two Bigfoot ornaments. One's different than the other one. Yeah, one's like kicking or something. I think it's stepping. And then we found a plastic army man flamethrower. Flamethrower guy foots now. What? What? Is that Bigfoot? <laughs> the Bigfoots are attacked. Did you see that? What was outside the window? I think that was Mom. Oh. Hey, what do you say we go hang these on the tree? Mm-hmm. No! Oh. I'm going to put my Bigfoot right next to your sister. Right there. And my snowman and Santa Claus. Why is there a donut by your sister? I don't know, but somebody bit it. Somebody eat a little bit of what? It. Yep. I took a bite out of the donut? Yep. That was probably her. Right there. Next to the candy cane? Right next to the candy cane. Rainbow candy. I'm going to put mine next to Mr. Creeper and Diamond Armor oh, Steve. Steve with his diamond armor. Oh, that's a good spot. Let's go see what else is in that box. Okay. What is all this stuff? I don't know. It's right here. This is what you, this could mean something. Wait, it's Morse code. I see something, I see something. What? Where? It's a P40. Wait, what? It's a P40. It's a P40. It's literally a P40. That's a World War II plane. It's a P40 flying tiger. I, you're right, it is. Look at those teeth. There he is! Oh, there's a pilot. Winnie. That looks awesome. Wait, it's broken. It's into pieces. What happened to it? Uh, maybe it got taken out by a German BF-109s. Wait a minute, no, 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 no. This the is a model speech. of some sort. Wait, I know what this is. This is one of those models that you have to put together. I think you're right. What do you say we put this together? Oh, yeah. Is it metal or plastic? Plastic. Ah, just plastic, but still, that's pretty cool. Oh! Okay, hit me in the head! Are you okay? Yeah, he hit me in the head though. Yeah, you got the tail Oh, he hit me in the chest. Oh, it doesn't want to come out. It doesn't want to come out, oh. the wing does. The wing came out.
I don't see any screws in here. I wonder how everything Wait, I catches. found them. I found them. You need to thank me. Yes, yeah, so there's some screws and there's some pins too. You see the pins? We forgot one thing. The screwdriver that came with it. Oh yeah. The first thing that we need to do is put on the tail wings. So we decided to go ahead and break it in half like this. And then we put on the tail wings. Yep. Let's put the pilot in the cockpit. It's right in there. Here we go. Second piece. Now let's put the prop in, and the other side has to be put on. Okay. And it should just snap in place. It's coming together. Yeah. Oh, look, the prop moves. So we attach the prop and we put together the cockpit and the rear wings or yep. the tail wings. Tail wings. Now let's put on the main wing. Now let's take the fuselage and let's put it on top of the wing. Just like that. Yeah, let's turn it over and we need to attach some screws. Okay, what do you think about this? Is this thing sweet or what? I know exactly where to put it. Where? I'll show you. Up there. Oh, yeah. Gotta be some more in here. Or is that it? Wait. Hmm? See anything else? Oh, yeah. I see something. It's an M3 Wii Commander tank. <gasps> it's a tank. It's an M3 Wii. Whoa. What happened to it? That's damaged. Oh, that's a World War II tank? Yep. This is a M3 Wii Commander tank. Commanders would drive these tanks. Commanders? Yep. Commanders of tank armies. Oh, I see a screwdriver. Is this gonna be hard? Oh, look at this, it has tracks. Mm-hmm. How is the question? We have a whole bunch of wheels there, and here is the turret and the cannon. And the fuselage. And yeah, the top part of the tank, whatever that's called. And then the bottom part, tracks. And the tracks. Hey, Dad. I don't know what these are. Yeah. Uh, the hardest part is gonna be the wheels, probably. I think the first step is going to be to put on the turret on top of the top part. Put this like right there. Yep, just like that. So we attach the turret. Now it's time to put on the wheels. Oh man. All of those wheels. Two, four, six, eight, ten, twelve. Twelve! So we finished putting on the wheels 
And the tracks fit on the wheels pretty well. Next, we need to put the top on. I think it just snaps in place. All right. So it's all finished. Look at that, the tracks even move. Dun, dun. This is the M3 Lee. Commander Tank. Is it another one? It's another one. Um, it's another model. It's a B-17 Flying Fortress! Yes! I can't believe that's in here. This one looks like it might be kind of difficult. Look at the engines. What's up with that? I don't know. It looks like Christmas lights kind of, oh, but it's engines. I Why lost we, one. One came on. Hey, I think this is going to be easier, Evan. There's no screws. Oh. And the engines just pop into the wing there. Oh, yeah, you're right. See? Oh, hold on. Mm. All right, Evan, did you do that side? All right, there we go. So we have four engines. Mm -hmm. Now let's attach the wings to the fuselage. All right, I slide first. It is so kind of. Evan put on one side. All right, Evan, let's do the other side now. Put that one on. That's Order up. steady. both wings on this flying fortress. Dun, dun, dun. Evan, what's next? Or actually, what's last? Tail wings. Two at a time. That's as far as I can get it, really. This one was a lot more easier. There were no screws, no pins. Mm. Didn't need to use a screwdriver. Dun, 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 dun. This was a bomber during World War II, huh? Yep, the most durable bomber in the US Air Force. Now it's time to put the plane on the stand since it is a model. Mm -hmm. It needs to go on the stand. Yeah. And it is attached. All finished. What do you think, Evan? Good. I think we did good. Yeah, this was a good find. Yep. Okay. Let's take all this out. Oh, wait, there's her sister. Uh -huh. Hey, Emily, you want to help us? Look, there's more most. Take it out. There's more most. Most more. Hey, wait a minute. Hey, there's one more thing in here. What is that? It's an M4 Sherman. Hey, oh, it's all dusty. Oh, and cracked. This one's cracked. Oh, yeah, a rat must have gotten in there or something. It's a World War II. Tank, the M4A3. Dun dun! The watch. Right there. 
But those are screws and some other bolts. Wow, this is gonna take a while to put this together. We have the turret right there, and there's all the wheels. And there's the two tracks, the bottom of the tank, there's the top of the tank. step is going to be putting on the turret onto the top of the tank and then this piece will go on the bottom and lock it in place. Emily and Evan put on the turret on top of the tank and they put some screws on the bottom. Good work everybody. Next we need to put all these tires onto the tank with these holding them in place and then we'll attach the tracks. Evan just finished putting on the wheels. Those took some time. Oh yeah. Okay, this was next. Okay, and on the top. Yeah. Make those like that. Almost finished. We need to put on the tracks next. Here goes Evan. Looks like Evan got one side of track on. Let's turn it around and it's like, okay, let's do another side. Okay, here's the track. All right, put that one on. This is the M4A3. Nothing else in here? Nothing but still some Morse code. We'll see you guys next time. Bye!